Hello artists, my name is Vibes and today we are going to be talking about relatable characters. Be sure to hit the like and sub buttons because it's important that people learn about this and every like helps more people find this video. Now, you might be wondering why is it important to make a relatable character? Well, let me tell you. So when a character is easily related to by an audience, it catches their attention and holds it. We can use YouTube as an example. The videos that are like types of kids you see in high school get millions of views because they're relatable, because they relate to people's past or current experiences. So you can make a character that does that exact thing, relate to other people's past and current experiences. This will retain people's attention and have them actually think about the character. In this video, we will be talking about how to make a visually relatable character, but I'm willing to make one that has to do with the character's story and setting in another video. Comment below if you'd like that. So, the look of a character is subtly important. If you have a character who is a medieval knight and lives in a futuristic world, it makes no sense to the audience and the audience just gets confused. So, making a character that's relatable also has to do with relating it to the setting and the story that's behind it. Then, having clothing that can be easily recognized by the audience also makes the character relatable. So, in this drawing, I gave the guy, we'll call him Jeff, I gave Jeff a suit and a tie, a briefcase and a floating cup of coffee that's coming up in a couple seconds there it is um but comment below if you what you think his job or occupation is if you're able to figure it out i most likely made a relatable character making a character that someone easily makes sense of will make a character easier for the audience to remember and thus they'll probably watch it you know there's always that moment where everybody says oh i'm bored let me just see what's on tv and the first show that they look for is the one that they can remember most so if you create a character that people are most likely to remember you're going to be able to do more um, get more of an audience making a relatable character is a very small part of what makes people come back to a show though or a comic but it's more about getting people to come for the first time i cannot say that i'm an expert on this but I feel that the information I give or gave to um, people is important for anyone who's looking to make a webcomic or animated cartoon. All of it is important. Now, let's talk about the character that doesn't make any sense. And I decided that I would draw one that wouldn't be relatable to much of an audience. And that should be coming up soon after I've finished color dodging this character. Um, now... Drawing a character that isn't relatable doesn't mean that a character isn't cute or is not well developed or that it's a bad character. This just means that the character doesn't relate to the audience and their experiences. So my character is supposed to be a coffee table that has a fully grown head, spikes in its body, and a tail, and a beret. I... Now you tell me if that relates to any one of you. Though some people may feel that the character is cute. Um, it doesn't relate to a large audience, and that reduces the number of people who will actually read the comic or uh, watch the show. Unless you're a coffee table with spikes, a head, and a tail, and a beret, I don't think that this character relates to you in any way, and it most likely won't relate to anybody in this um, audience. Thus, you lose in interest in the character really quickly, and so does your audience, and I did that as well since I stopped and didn't even color it. Overall, making a relatable character is actually super important, but you need to know who you're trying to relate to. So looking at the demographic that you're trying to hit and using other people's work as examples of what you need to do will help you to be able to make a more relatable character to the audience that you're looking to hit. A character's look is subtle, but it makes a, um, an important first impression. So make sure that the character is easily recognized and that the audience can easily make sense of it. That way they can remember it. You can make a character that um, relates to any age so that everyone can enjoy it and that you hit the biggest audience. If you found this helpful, leave a like. If you're making a webcomic or a cartoon, tell me or link it in the comments. If you like more content, subscribe. It always motivates me to do more. And always remember, your art is good no matter what anyone says, including you.